So you bought a fragrance and it was supposed to last all day, but it's been a few hours and you're just not smelling it anymore. I have the secret for you. Today I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to make your perfume, your fragrances, your fine fragrance mist, anything that you are spraying on yourself, how to make it last all day from when you go to work to when you come home and you know you still smell super good. Honestly, what is a perfume if it's not going to last all day? I want to smell good from the moment I put it on to the moment I'm getting ready to take a shower and go to sleep, honey, okay? to ensure that my perfume and my fragrances last all day is that I layer them. Layering is so important if you want to smell good all day, okay? When I layer my fragrances, I like to use a shower gel, then I use a body lotion, and then I'll use a perfume or fine fragrance mist in that same exact scent. Some examples include the Amazing Grace Body Mousse by Philosophy. I have this, I love this, it's absolutely amazing if you ever get the chance to try it. I actually purchased this in Marshalls for about $6.50 and it goes for $40 online. Amazing deal, I'm telling you guys. Marshalls and TJ Maxx is where it's at. I also use this hydrating body gel in the exact same scent, also from Philosophy. And then I have the Perfume. So all three of these I would use at the exact same time to ensure that this is going to stay on all day. I would use this body mousse first and probably straight out of the shower. It's super hydrating and it's super refreshing on the skin and it's very cooling and especially if it's like a hot summer day, this would be the perfect thing for you. And this here is absolutely gorgeous. I love it and I think that this is also very hydrating and cooling, especially during the summertime. And then to finish it off, I would obviously add this perfume. It's very beautiful and again it's layering i have the same scent in a lot of different products just to ensure that it's going to stay on all day another example i have my la vie this is from lancome i use this only on special occasions when i definitely want to smell good all day because honestly this by itself is just <laughs> it's everything and you really don't need much to make it last okay but again if i really want this to stay on all day i'm going to layer it i also have the body lotion and this is like a perfume lotion so i would put this on and then this would be the finishing product and this is going to stay on forever okay it's probably going to stay on your clothes and even after you wash it because it's so strong and it's so scented and it's so beautiful also i have a travel size version of this so after you know i'm not bringing this outside of my house so i'm going to take this and i'm going to keep it in my purse this is going to be with me all day if i just feel like okay i just need a little bit more i have this on me and i've already layered it with the lotion and the perfume and now i have a little travel size of this i'm just going to spray it on me and i should be good the next thing that i do to ensure that my scent is going to last all day okay the scent that i took my time to put on in the morning it's going to stay on until later on in the night i use oils this right here is the palmer's cocoa butter formula deep radiant gel oil i put this all over my body from my arms to my legs to my chest area this is amazing and you can see i've used a whole a lot of it already and this is going to help you so much the oilier your skin is before you add a fragrance the more the scent will hold when you put it on to dry skin the perfume doesn't really have much to attach itself to so once you add this oil all over your body it really helps the scent seep into your skin and helps it linger and last all day i use this at night sometimes but sometimes i don't really want to feel that oil on my skin but during the day especially if i want my skin to have that shine i'll use this and then i will apply my fragrance on top 
with a fragrance lasting all day you want to definitely make sure that your skin is not dry dry skin honestly just isn't the move you don't want to do dry skin you want to make sure that your skin is hydrated and moisturized it makes everything last longer and it helps you feel better too because i know myself i can't spray anything on my body if my skin is too dry and cracked it honestly will leave your skin feeling even more dry and i'm sure you don't want that another thing scents fade faster on dry skin you don't want that to happen so get an oil if you're not necessarily into an oil like this one i would recommend a regular less scented body moisturizer this right here is the dub beauty cream you can purchase this in marshall's tj maxx and also at dollar tree this is also an alternative for the oil because it's a moisturizer and applying a lightly scented or non-scented moisturizer before applying your fragrance will allow it to last a lot longer another thing know the difference between a toilette and a perfume there is a difference the perfume is more intense and the toilette is less intense which means one is going to last longer than the other so make sure that when you're purchasing a perfume or a fragrance look if it says toilette or perfume because Trust me, it makes a huge difference. See, this here is the Coco Chanel Mademoiselle Paris. This is the Toilette. I'm almost done with it. If you guys want to check out my most recent video, I uploaded a fragrance video and I talked about all the perfumes that last all day. I'll leave that down below and I'll also leave it here for you guys so you can look but don't leave this video yet but i talked about this in that video and i am almost done with it this here is the perfume version they smell alike but this one is stronger and it lasts longer so definitely make sure that you guys know the difference and that will help you so much when applying your perfume you want to apply it to your pulse points which means your wrist inside your elbows on your neck and behind your knees and once you do that don't rub it in don't do this please don't do that in a sense it crushes the fragrance let it sit on your skin and let it emanate once you spray just let it be just let it be don't rub it in let it sit let it settle and that'll make it last and that also goes for spraying it in the air like this and walking into it don't do that spray it directly on your skin direct is the best way to keep it on longer spraying it in the air honestly waste the product so try not to do that at nighttime before I go to bed I like to use scents that aren't as strong just because I don't really like wearing strong fragrances to sleep so for example i have my philosophy products here these are the fresh cream by philosophy this is a shower gel this is a body lotion and this is a body mist they're all the same scent and it's another way of layering what i would do with this is i would rub this all over my body i'd shower with this i'd lotion up with this and then i would spray this on myself it's also best to apply these things when your skin is a bit moist and damp it just helps the fragrance last longer because your skin is more moisturized especially when you're just coming out of the shower and your pores are a lot more open it helps a lot i spray my arms my legs my body my chest every area with this first and then once i'm done with that i'll go ahead and put on my clothes for the night and then i will make sure to spray my clothes again making sure it's on your skin and then putting it on your clothes is a great way to make your perfume and your fragrances last all day and i quote perfume is a personal magic a first impression and a lasting recollection that's a quote that i absolutely love and it's so true you usually remember people by the way they smell and sometimes it leaves a really good impression or a bad one but it's true your scent your smell your fragrance it's important i also really love this saying and that is a woman's perfume is her signature that even after she leaves the room you'll know that she was there and it's so true i know that there's many times that after a person has even left the room i can still smell their perfume and they definitely have mastered how to make it last and that's something i love and i hope that you all can learn how to do that and we can all just smell heavenly together 
I thank you guys so much for watching this video. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys want to see next from me. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and make sure to comment down below and let me know your thoughts. I definitely love reading your comments and I want to get to know you guys. So leave a comment down below. Let me know if you've been using any of these tips or let me know if you have any of the fragrances that I showed in this video. If you haven't yet, make sure that you subscribe and join the Living Ash family. We are over 1,000 subscribers and I'm so excited. This is so amazing. And lastly, make sure you turn on that post notification bell so that you get notified when I post my next video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.